today I'm hosting the World Cup, but every player represents the league they play for, which means Alan will represent England because he playing in the Premier League, Jude Bellam will represent Spain because he playing in La Liga. I'm moving to our first matchup in the round of 16, Italy will be going against the United States, and Italy are the favourite to win this match because how stacked their squad is, and it was level between the both sides until this happened in the 90th minute of the match. And now the Italian side are about to take this corner, and Quarascalia pass to Barella, and Barella cross the ball, and Prima with the header and the goal, what in the 10 minute of the match? Wow! It is over for the United States and it was definitely over for them and now the Italian side have eliminated them out of the competition. Now Italy will be moving to the quarterfinal. Up next, Spain will be going against Denmark and Spain have the momentum and rhythm going in their favour as they will get their first goal of the match with the help of Lewandowski. And you will with the nice crew pass to Lewandowski and Lewandowski. Oh, what a nice kill move and Lewandowski with the shot where a goal. And Spain went up adding to the advantage with a goal from Griezmann. And a nice crew pass to cover and cover. Pass the ball to Griezmann and Griezmann with the shot and the goal. Wow! And that was what Spain needed to eliminate Denmark out of the competition. Now they'll be facing Italy in the quarter final. And our next matchup will be Germany going against South Korea. And South Korea wouldn't pose any threat as Germany scored not one but two goals to eliminate them out of the competition. Now they'll be moving to the quarter final. And our next matchup will be Saudi Arabia going against India. The Saudi Arabia having players like Cristiano Ronaldo, Neymar, and Benzema. This should be a walk in the park for them. And Neymar is with the ball. What a nice game move. And Neymar cross the ball. And Cristiano Ronaldo with the header. And you go! Wow! And now Ngola Kante with a nice throw pass to Cristiano Ronaldo. And Ronaldo is going 1v1 with the goalie. And Ronaldo with the shot. And they go! Wait, Cristiano Ronaldo is winning number 30. That is so weird. Oh my god. And now Kante pass it to Neymar. Neymar pass it back to Kante. And Kante to Mares. And Mares play the shot. And they go! What? Wow! What a goal by Riyad Mahrez! Is he throwing up guns now in all world? And that was all the Saudi Arabia needed to eliminate them out of the competition. Now they will be moving to the quarter final to face Germany. And moving to the other side, Netherlands are going to be facing Argentina. And there was nothing to show between the two sides until this happened in the 78th minute of the match. And now De La Cruz crosses to Fernandez and Fernandez pass the ball to Baku and Baku with the shot and the goal! What? Argentina might pull an offset, man. What a goal! And Argentina definitely pulled an offset as they eliminated Netherlands to move to the quarter final without Messi. Damn. And our next matchup will be England going against Switzerland. And this England team is stuck. I would like this will definitely be a hard fight for Switzerland. Now Mosala is going with the ball and he's going all alone. And Mosala is going. Oh, what a nice kill move. I pass it to De Bruyne and De Bruyne nope. play the shot and the goal. What was that goal? Wow. Premier League are not coming to play here. And Alan pass the ball to Salah, and now Salah is going. And Salah turn the ball around, pass the ball to Alan, and Alan with the shot and the goal. What a goal by Alan! What was that goal? Wow! And with as England have now eliminated Switzerland out of the competition, now they've been moving to the quarter final. And their next matchup in the round of 16 will be France going against Scotland. And I would like to with this France squad are mainly PSG players. And immediately earlier in the match, France got their first goal. But surprisingly, Scotland find a way to equalize. And now Asensio, Asensio pass the ball to Aubameyang. And Aubameyang, oh no! That is a tackle. And that is going to be a free kick. And Mbappe will be the one taking the free kick. And now Mbappe, and Mbappe with the shot, what a goal by Mbappe! What? What a nice free kick! Damn! Wow! And now Akimi pass the ball to Ramos. And Ramos pass it to Asensio. Asensio with the shot. What a nice block by the defender. And Mbappe with the shot and the goal! What? Damn! This match is now definitely over. What a nice performance by France. What a nice performance by Kylian Mbappe. And France wasn't done as Vitia added to their advantage by scoring another goal. And with that, France have eliminated Scotland out of the competition. Now they'll be moving to the quarter final. And their last matchup in the round of 16 will be Portugal going against China. And Portugal were in no doubt of winning this match as they got their first goal in, which will be their difference maker in winning the match. And now they'll be facing France in the quarter final. And their first matchup in the round of 16 will be Italy going against Spain. This is going to be a very big one, boys. And Kiesa. Pass the ball to Rafael Leo and Rafael Leo cruising through the box and Rafael with the shot and the goal. Wow, what a goal by the Italian side. Wow, and the Spanish side couldn't find a way to respond. This is the end of the road for them. Now the Italian side will be moving to the semi final. And our next matchup in the quarter final will be Saudi Arabia going against Germany. And now both to Savage. 
and Savage. Still holding on to the ball. I pass to Big Benz and Benzema play the shot and they go. Wow. The Saudi Arabian team are looking unstoppable. I won't lie. And the Benzema goal will be the difference between the two teams. Now the Saudi Arabia side will be facing Italy in the semi-final. And up next, it will be Argentina going against England. And Argentina will be going against the script as they scored the first goal of the match. And pass the ball to Varela. And Varela to Fernandez. Fernandez to De La Cruz. And De La Cruz with the shot and the goal. Wow. Argentina might be willing to put a lot of sets in this match. Wow! And England were not ready to back down either as they got their goal back. And Kevin De Bruyne crossed the ball to the box. And Salah with the nice ball control. And Salah, still Salah. And Salah passed the ball to Kevin De Bruyne. No. Kevin De Bruyne to Saka, no! And Salah with the end of what a goal! Wow! England are not ready to back down, man. And now Haaland. And Haaland is still going. And Haaland passed the ball to Salah. And Salah, what a nice no. ball movement. And Salah, no! What a nice save by the goalkeeper! And after the 90 minutes, there was nothing to separate the both sides. Now they are heading straight to the extra time. And Trent and Arnold cross the ball to Fernandez. Fernandez to Alan. Alan with the shot and they go! Wait, what? That was an offside! No! No! And the match is still level after the extra time now. They are heading straight to the penalties. And Cavani will be the first one taking the penalty for Argentina. And Cavani convert the goal in. And now Bruno Fernandez. Play it to the bottom right corner and back over Argentina. Wait, what was that penalty? And Ederson couldn't save it. And Bukayo Saka played the shows. Wow. And now Anson is playing for Argentina. And Anson smashed the ball to the back of the net. And now Mosala playing for England. No, he missed. Ooh. And now, if you should score this penalty, it is all over for England. And now let's see De La Cruz. And De La Cruz. No. Now it is all over for England. It is over for the Premier League team. And our last matchup in the quarterfinal will be France going against Portugal. And there will be nothing to show for between the both sides after the 90 minutes. Now they are heading straight to the extra time. And Aubameyang, Aubameyang going round the box. And Aubameyang passed the ball to Mbappe. And Mbappe, Mbappe, and Mbappe is still holding on to the ball. And Mbappe played the shot and the goal. What? This might be the winning goal for France. Wow. This might be the winning goal, I won't lie. Thinking all was over, but Portugal once again proved you should never count them out as they score a goal to equalize the match. And the ball to Di Maria. And Di Maria. Holding on to the ball. And Di Maria. Play the shot and the goal. Wow. Damn, this match is so competitive. And in the penalty, it was going back and forth between the both sides, but eventually the Portugal side came out on top. And now they've eliminated France out of the competition. Now they'll be moving to the semi final. Now to the final four. Our first matchup in the semi final will be Saudi Arabia going against Italy. And Latario Martinez. And Latario Martinez. Odin strong and tight to the ball. And Latario Martinez. Pass to Victor Osimhen. Osimhen with the shot. But he missed. And just like the other two last matches, we're heading straight to the penalty in this one again. And Latario Martinez will be the first player taken for Italy. And he scored. And now Neymar for the Saudi Arabia side. And Neymar. Calm it down. And Neymar played the shot. And he scored. And now Barella. Barella. Make that goal look so easy. And now time for Cristiano Ronaldo to take his penalty. And Ronaldo he missed. Oh my goodness. And Tsunami is about to take the penalty for the Italian side. And make that goal look so easy also. And Fabio can he keep the Saudi Arabia dreams alive. And he scored. And now Rabio. And Rabio can he make the oh he missed. And now Benzema can he score to level this penalty and he scored. Go. And now Quadrado is about to take his own penalty. And Quadrado no he missed. And now. If Neves can score this penalty, it is all over for the Italian side. And the Saudi Arabian side will be moving to the final. Can he score the goal? And he scored. And it is all over for the Italian side. Wow. Now that the Saudi Arabian side are now in the final, let's see who they are going to be facing between Argentina and Portugal. And the Portuguese side will have their start in the match as they score the first goal of the match. And Rafa is in the box with the nice ball movement. Pass the ball to Jamario and Jamario with the goal. Wow. And Rafa sprinting with the ball. And Rafa still going all alone. Rafa with the nice movement. And Rafa still going all alone. And Rafa holding on to the ball. Pass it to Jan Mario. And Jan Mario with the pass. And play the shot and they go. Wow, they've doubled their lead. Nice. Portugal might be the one facing Saudi Arabia in the final. And with those two goals, Portugal have eliminated Argentina out of the competition. 
they will be facing Saudi Arabia in the final. And now to the final, let's see what league have the best squad in the world and let the game begin. And the Saudi Arabia side will be the first one to get the first goal of the match as this happened. And Cristiano Ronaldo pass the ball to Benzema and Benzema to Savic, Savic to Mane and Mane with the shot and the goal. Wow. Damn, the Saudi Arabia side seems to stop people, man. Rafa pass the ball to Di Maria and Di Maria. Di Maria is doing his thing with the skill move and Di Maria take it back and Di Maria still is it toying with the defender and Di Maria what is he doing and the defender what Alastelius with the tackle and it is now a penalty and now Portugal with the chance to level the match and it is a goal wow and the pressure is now between the both sides as they will go to the extra time and in the extra time this will happen ball to Benzema and Benzema Pass it to Mares, Mares with a nice skill move, and Mares with a nice pass, and Savage with the goal. What? This might be the winning goal. Wow. Damn. What a nice gameplay. Nice pass by Mares. And with that, the Saudi NBA side are the League World Cup winners. And thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Peace out.